The broadcast is now starting. All attendees are in listen-only mode. Good morning and thank you for joining us during these difficult times. This webinar is how we at Utilities 400 can help you support your customers, partners and remote workers through delivering their meaningful and formatted documentation from a spool file, your ERP database, or indeed a mix of both during these, this COVID-19 lockdown. Now, this webinar is non-technical, but is aimed at giving you an insight into how this technology could be used and help your business through this pandemic. The webinar is brought to you by Utilities 400, industry experts and solution providers for the IBM I Enterprise. Today, we'll introduce you to technologies that can help you get information to who needs it, when they need it, and in a format of choice using technologies developed by IBM I experts for the modern IBM I Enterprise. Please do stick around until the end, as we'll provide you with a way in which you can get this software free of charge to help you through these difficult times. Now, my name is Andy Nicholson, and I shall be your host for the next 20 ish minutes. Now, before we dive right into the presentation, first a bit of housekeeping. You'll notice that on the right hand side of your screen is the GoToWebinar Management Console. Within this console is the option that will allow you to ask questions. Now, due to echo and audio feedback, we find this the best way to record and answer all the questions that you may have. So time permitting, I'll answer these in a Q&A session at the end of the webinar. If you miss anything or would like to rewatch anything during today's presentation, don't worry. This webinar is being recorded. You'll receive a link to recording approximately 24 hours after we finish the webinar. Now, obviously, I'm broadcasting from home. So if you hear my dog barking in the background or the occasional shrill voice, don't worry. This isn't the developers coding. <laughs> it's just my family not taking my instructions for quiet. This is perfectly normal. With this in mind, pull up a chair, grab a hot cup of coffee as we're about to begin. Now, before we deep dive into how we can support your remote workers during this pandemic, I thought it pertinent to provide you with a little bit of background on who Utilities 400 are. Don't worry, it's just one slide, but I thought it would be reassuring to know that today's presentation comes from the industry leaders in IBM I Integration and Intelligence Solutions. Utilities 400 has a proud history of supporting businesses on IBM I. We've accumulated over 100 years of AS400 experience poured into these products developed to meet the needs of businesses running on I. Now, this six cog diagram shows you how we keep the wheels turning for the IBM I enterprise. With over 500 businesses worldwide relying on our solutions, we provide a unique mix of expertise and experience that help evolve your business processes from process automation, real-time business intelligence and portals, to integration and document management. We have the toolbox of solutions that can help your business become more competitive through better enabling any ERP system on the IBM I. Today, we're concentrating on how we can support remote workers, suppliers, partners and customers to complete this. I'd like to discuss these first two cogs and how we can support the stakeholders through getting them the information they need in a format of choice using our solution, Route 1. But how would this work and what exactly is Route 1 anyway? Well, Route 1 is a multimodal solution that addresses your data extraction, transformation, and distribution requirements. Whatever these may be, be this replacing pre printed stationery with your own pre formatted e forms, generating data warehouses quickly, reliably, and securely, or producing scalable spreadsheets with pivots and multiple workbooks. And there's more besides. We don't discriminate. It's your data, your choice. The platform is truly scalable. To achieve this flexibility, Route 1 uses three simple steps. These are extract, transform, and distribute. Now, allow me a couple of minutes just to take you through these. The first step is extract. We believe the IBM I is an amazing transactional platform. 
However, when it comes to extracting data where, when, and how you want it, it's somewhat lacking, and that's why we're here. And Root 1 is unique in its ability to extract data from both the database and the spool file, or indeed a mix of both. Once the data is extracted, we need to transform it into a format of choice. Beavis reports and statements in spreadsheets, alerts and text messages, invoices and orders in PDF and more. It is not just about transforming the file type, it's about making the data meaningful. So perhaps you're uh, extracting the date field uh, in an American format, be that you know, month, day, year but need it populating in your database in UK format, which will be day, month, year. Then Route 1 will deal with this transformation logic too. And then there's Unicode. Route 1 can create data using Unicode too. For example, creating Chinese characters for your customers over there, or perhaps adding an emoji to an SMS alert. You'll be surprised how popular that is. We transform your data using your rules, pre and post format your information to suit your business and application requirements. In a nutshell, it's your data, present it how you want it. And then there's distribute. Distribute your data in the format of choice, in speeds far greater than conventional technology. Trigger emails, populate data warehouses, securely send files via FTP or secure FTP, automate events, fax, and even SMS. Route One offers a wealth of options for distribution of data from IBM I to most other platforms. With these three simple steps, we can deliver your data to who you want, when they want it, in a format of their choice, making data appropriate, timely, and meaningful without having to create and manage endless RPG code. So how do these principles help with the current COVID-19 situation and remote working? Well, let's take a look at some of the requirements your business may need for your remote workers and stakeholders, such as your suppliers and customers. First, you will still want to invoice customers and send them business documentation to your partners. Working from home means that they may need to have access to data uh, when they need it and in a multitude of formats. Management will need reports, many of these new to develop, due to developing situations. Statements will have to be sent, extracts will have to be complete, files transferred. But with remote working comes a greater issue of control, business continuity, the big words there, and security. Now let's take each requirement and see how they would normally be addressed within the typical IT department. Now, a typical IT department may have many different products to complete all these tasks. One product for electronic forms, a different product for reports, maybe some bespoke code for alerts and extracts, and perhaps even another product for services for file transfers and conversions. In a normal day-to-day -day business, this may be manageable, but is this desirable or indeed fit for purpose for the modern IBM I IT team tasked with business continuity? We would argue that in today's climate, best practice would be to, where possible, consolidate business operations to improve response and to stakeholders with more meaningful data and information while simultaneously reducing complexity, ongoing costs, and of course, IT resource. Reducing your portfolio of unsupported programs and bespoke applications reduces operational risks. You will be better prepared as training on one platform will provide you with the ability to counter many scenarios within one fully supported solution. As a result, change and build requests could be simplified, better managed, and expedited exped exponentially. An interesting byproduct, not necessarily part of any business continuity plan, may be that your IT department could save money on countless annual support contracts. But let's get back to the diagram and see how this all fits together. So as discussed with one platform, we're able to reduce risk and the need for individual products or bespoke code. 
we can replace each product or address new requirements with one platform from addressing database transfers from IBMI to other database formats such as Access, Oracle and SQL to automating alerts or messaging in SMS. Route 1 removes the need for bespoke and unsupported programs. It removes risk and provides for one platform you'll need to, to address all your IBMI document and data extraction transformation and distribution needs. Let's take a look at how we are going to do this. First, with electronic forms. With Route 1, we can produce professional forms for invoices, statements, delivery notes, or anything that requires a form-based output from your enterprise system, be this on the DB2 database, within a spool file, or indeed a mix of both. Now, to create these forms, we use the most widely used creation tool on the planet, Microsoft Word. This allows you to build and manage a library of templates for your invoices, statements, pick lists, and more easily. So zero code and no need to learn new software or pay a third party to edit an overlay or just for a small change. With Route 1, it's so easily administered. As part of the routines, we can create beautifully formatted forms, convert to a PDF and forward via email. And depending upon document, we can automate to print to different designated printers or even deliver the document to a designated cloud or network location, FTP or secure FTP folder. We've built choice into the solution. We can also use this technology to populate other pre-formatted documents too. In this example, we're populating information from the database with a pre-configured HTML document for automated dispatch confirmation. In this particular case, the email is automatically generated and sent when the consignment was scanned onto a courier's van, so triggered by events within the IBMI enterprise system. We've also added a soft copy of the PDF here too, as part of the email designation. By now, I hope you're getting a picture that Route 1 does more than data extraction. Route 1 is about making data meaningful. Creating easy to manage professional electronic forms being just one area, but we can go further with this technology through post-processing routines. Route 1 provides the tools that allow you to deliver beautifully formatted reports in Excel, for example. Management, partners, customers, and your remote workers can have access to the data that they need in a format they need presented in a way that's meaningful. So rather than just see data in rows and columns when they open a spreadsheet, they can see meaningful information with pivots, charts, and graphs. Using these same routines we use for forms and reports, Route 1 has the ability to extract, transform, and load data into other external databases, such as Oracle, Access, SQL, and even another DB2 database if needed. As part of these ETL routines, you can add logic to perform conversions, such as date amendments, currency changes, and translations at this, all with speeds of up to 10 times faster than conventional client server and ODBC technologies. Now, the way this works is in its architecture. Route 1 comes in two parts. The engine of a product that deals with the extraction and transformation resides on the IBMI, while the data delivery and distribution part of the product resides on a Wintel server. Bits allows us to multi-channel streams of data, for example, Exporting terabytes of data, even using Route 1, takes some time. With Route 1, we can have one Route 1 client dealing with this data load, while a separate client or clients deal with form extraction, reports, and the like. 
This makes the solution as light and as flexible to your business requirements without limiting the power and output. And a great credit to the technical architecture of this foresight too. So practically, in a real life situation, how could this all be applied? Well, in many ways. Let me give you just three examples. First, let's go back to the most recent process discussed, that of ETL. Take this example from a customer who wanted to build an external data warehouse in SQL from multiple loads from various IBM I databases for distribution analysis. Using conventional client server technology, this build took over 60 hours to complete. Now, the company in question is a fast moving goods company that needed to analyze this information daily. So this time period simply wasn't acceptable. But through the introduction of Route 1, however, using our low level socket technology, we reduced this time to less than five hours. Not only this, but the transmission speed, should it fail, and a power cut or hardware failure, for example, with Route One's audited recovery process, we can pick up from a fail point and not have to restart as you would with a conventional process. Route One can also be used as a conduit between the data in your system and your information stakeholders. In this example, a well-known British retailer used these solutions for delivering data to their logistics partners. For this, Route 1 is the primary solution for delivering data in multiple formats and methods depending upon the file and receipts requirements of a recipient. All these processes are automated to be fulfilled via a schedule or dynamically depending upon a value or trigger. Here we're creating CSVs and XMLs and even text files depending upon the logistic partner requirement to be delivered by a secure FTP and indeed email. Indeed, we can have a process that runs in reverse from this so we can capture information too, but more on that in a future webinar. Finally, let's take an example from Aramark who had the mammoth task of twice a month manually splitting 500, a 500 page report. Once split, it was then printed in the relevant regional office on letterhead of paper. Each office then either posted the report to a relevant stakeholder. Now, all this process, it took an average of eight or nine days to produce, revise and finalize this information and the further days to deliver to the correct person, department, partner and customer. This process was arduous. It took too much time and had too high a cost in human resource, stationary and postage. Through the introduction of Route 1, Aramark were able to extract the monthly spool file, split the 5,000 pages into around 3,000 individual reports and deliver to the relevant stakeholder automatically. Route 1 saved thousands in pre-printed stationary and postage costs days and weeks in human resource while simplifying the reporting and form creation process. Not only this, but the old process would have been unmanageable during this pandemic. Only through the automation data flow with the introduction of Route 1 could business continue, continuity be achieved. If one of these scenarios fits a need or well, you saw the sense in protecting IT resource during this business continuity um, slides earlier, please consider taking advantage of our offer of a free license of Route 1 for up to 90 days. These are issues depending upon requirement for the length of your economic lockdown. We believe that Route 1 could help your business through the crisis and beyond. Should you agree, please do take advantage of this offer. To do so, please visit the website on your screen now and complete the form. We'll be in touch shortly to deal with your request. Our thanks again for joining us in this uh, 
<laughs> pandemic during this really bad times. But before we close the session, I've received a couple of questions. Uh, I've got time to read these out. So I'm banging on the 20 minutes. So we've got li little time before our half an hour is out. Now, John N asks, how do you go about creating these routines? Um, well, first, there's no coding requirement required. If you know query, then you're on a great footing to start writing what we call definitions. Now, definitions are like query, but with whistles and bells that allow us to do more things such as adding transformation and distribution logic. Using root one, we have the power of an RPG programmer without having to be an RPG programmer. Indeed, writing definitions is not only more simple than coding, but quicker too, meaning that you have and you could feasibly create more than six times more definitions than RPGs in, this, in a similar uh, time period. Not only this, but they're stored within a central library system that's easy to manage and each definition can be copied and edit to produce similar requests. Therefore, again, multiplying the speed to uh, getting these out to your users um, exponentially. I hope that answers that uh, question on, on creating routines. Not going overly technical within this webinar, it's all about just introducing the solution. We have further resource online for this. Now, Peter W asks if there is on, any online training. Uh, yes, there is an online video. Uh, I'll send a link as part of a follow up to this webinar. Uh, it's not too in-depth, but we'll give you more technical insight into how to produce some of the examples that you saw within this introductory webinar. Uh, not only this, but we do have an extensive manual that includes a starting guide too. Um, you'll receive this with your license once you fill that form uh, on our website. So please go ahead and do that. My thanks again for joining us today. Uh, yeah, these are unprecedented times and we hope that this webinar and subsequent license of Route 1 will help support the IBMI community. More than this, however, I wish you, the viewer, all the very best. Be well, stick to the published advice and we'll get through this. I look forward to seeing you on the other side, but in the meantime, do keep in touch. We're happy to talk, we're happy to help. And thank you again for joining us. And on behalf of the good people of Utilities 400, please do stay safe. Thank you and goodbye. <laughs>